Welcome to Joftech Manufacturing. My name is Fred Simpson, and today I'm going to demonstrate for you in real time the recommended method of converting an 8-foot 2-lamp T12 fixture. Let's get started. First thing you need to consider is to turn the power off and make everything safe to work on. Remove your existing lamps. Discard the lamps appropriately. Next thing we want to do is to remove the existing ballast cover, starting at one end. It's ideal to keep your ladder in the same location or just move it slightly because you don't want to spend a lot of time moving your ladder around while doing and performing the retrofit. Discarding this cover uh, because it's in pretty rough shape, and I think it will give the new fixture a nice finished look with new covers on it. Next, you'll want to remove your existing sockets. In some cases, they just slide out of the end plate. In other cases, they may be held fastened in with a bolt. These ones slide out quite easy to get out. Next thing you want to do is to disconnect the existing feed in. Again, be sure your power is off. Yeah. Cut the wire leading to your socket plate and dispose of them accordingly. Next you'll need to remove your existing ballast. In some cases you'll be working with 347 volts. In other cases you will be working with 120 In this case, the bolt that's holding the ballast is also the center ballast cover mounting bolt that will need to be removed so that it doesn't interfere with the new retrofit plates. Once you've removed all of the ballast clamps and covers, you'll want to mount your new four lamp electronic ballast. The idea being, when mounting the ballast, that the two yellow wires of the four lamp electronic instant start ballast and the black and white are facing toward the center of the fixture channel width. For this you need to screw it approximately starting at the end six inches from the end. There may be cases where the holes are provided for you for attaching the ballasts. In some cases you will need to screw in the ballast because the mounts don't match up. So once you've got the ballast in place, you'll want to attach your universal socket plates to each end as well as the center. The center is provided with shunted sockets for instant start ballasts and two blues go are common to one plate and the two reds are common to the other center plate which has no wires in it. Stay there. You'll see that the quick connects are quite easy to work with on the new socket tracks. The end plates 
can be connected to the ballast as well. fixtures. In this case we have a standalone fixture and once removing the cover, the end cover, you you there's no way to fasten it back to the fixture. So the easiest way to do this is to turn this plate 180 degrees and attach it back into the fixture using self-drilling screws. In your conversion kit you'll we will have some extra screws to attach this particular plate. Being sure it's lined up to the end, simply screw it back into the end of the channel. Where you have a row mounted situation, you will not likely required to perform this. There you have your end cap intact. Now you can take one of your pre-wired end plates, yellow wires, and attach it to the fixture channel. This fixture channel happens to be four and a half inches. This plate works on any fixture between four and five inches. Simply telescope out the sliders on each side, attach it over your channel, squish it back into place right on the end of the fixture. Be sure that you are fully to the end of the fixture because the lamp spacing is critical when trying to install your new lamps. Attach each side of the end plate into the new channel, into the new channel. Turn up the head, dress your wires up so that you put the covers on easily when finished. This step should be repeated to the opposite end. Try not to make too much of a mess while you're doing these retrofits. Pouches are always a good idea to wear when performing this. Same thing again, you need to flip invert, if you will, 180 degrees the existing socket plate and reattach it as an end cap. Yeah. 